Nobody knows how to throw a party quite like Las Vegas. And when it comes to honoring the King of Pop's birthday celebration, trust me, they pulled out all the stops. Our new Vegas correspondent, James Vaughn, takes us to the over-the-top celebration. For the second year in a row, Cirque du Soleil and the estate of Michael Jackson invited fans and close friends to celebrate the birthday of the King of Pop inside the Michael Jackson One Theater at the Mandalay Bay Resort and Casino. We went to check it out, and it was a very special and heartwarming event. The day-long celebration included two additional Michael Jackson One Show performances, a private meet and greet with representatives of the estate, members of the show's creative team, and close friends of Michael's. Growing up in Wisconsin, you know, wannabe dancer, wanting to be on MTV, and then actually getting selected um, to be on the Dangerous Tour was like, you know, the biggest moment for me, wherein it really like kind of changed like the way I view dance and creativity and life. And then now, years later, being able to direct MJ One for Michael just makes it full circle, and you know, now it's his birthday. Anytime you get a chance to experience Michael's music and his artistry, that makes every day special. So for me, it's almost like every day is Michael's birthday because I had the privilege of working on Michael Jackson one, and I hope that all the fans can appreciate this man's artistry. And another fan that you may recognize came to the party. The YouTube dancing sensation with almost 17 million hits, Brett Nichols. Nichols performed Billie Jean, the same routine that scored in first place in his high school's talent show competition. Of course, the world will never forget Michael Jackson, and Las Vegas will continue to pay tribute to him through the masterful production of Michael Jackson One. It's a great show. If you haven't seen it, check it out. I'm sure Michael would be very proud.